Tonight we're taking you inside the Macomb County Jail because the people who work there have a message. Yes, they say that the job you think it is, it really isn't, and they're hoping you might want to join them. Our Nick Manicelli talked to a few corrections deputies to get their perspective. Welcome inside of the Macomb County Jail where there are more than 150 correctional deputies working here around the clock 24-7 ensuring inmate safety and their own safety. They could use more of those correctional deputies though, but before they can do that, they have to fight the stigma of what their job is actually like. There is a reputation, a stigma of what happens inside county jails. But it turns out the problems, riots, unruly inmates, they're not an everyday occurrence. This is our, uh, our medical unit. Corrections Deputy Bill Fassbender has worked inside the jail for 14 years. I think everybody feels that the stigma is when you come here, like everybody in here is like ruthless, out to get you, and you can never stop looking behind watching your back, and it's not the case. Most days are good days. Corrections Deputy Chelsea Benedict works the floor with the most violent offenders and doesn't have that many bad days. You need to have a thick skin and realize that every day for them while they're incarcerated is a bad day. Even if they're having a good day, it's still a bad day because they're stuck in here and they can't do what they want. However, situations do arise where things can get out of hand. To keep the correction staff and other inmates safe, the jail has an internal SWAT team. Team leader Nick Scardino says when the team is activated, usually their presence alone is enough. They see us coming and they will just comply and go along with whatever we need them to do for their safety and the officer's safety as well. So with the stigma corrected, the Macomb County Sheriff's Department is hoping to recruit more correctional deputies who earn up to $68,000 a year. This is not one of those jobs where you would sit there and be like, oh, I'm bored at the end of the day. That never happens. Captain Lori Mitch runs the county jail and says the benefits are great with shift options and there isn't much overtime as long as they hire enough people. It is a great job. We work with great people. Uh, sometimes we have challenging situations, but we work with great people. I have some of the best co-workers that I've ever had. Which explains why she has been there for 25 years. That and the opportunity to change lives. I hope I'm making a difference. I try my best to make a difference, and um, I've seen people outside of here, and they've come to me and said, thank you so much for all your help. They introduced me to their family, and they tell me about where they're at and how they're coming along, and they're maybe not where they want to be yet, but they're there, and it makes me feel pretty good. In Mount Clemens, Nick Monticelli, Local 4.